All right, we're here at the Woodbridge Supercharger and Jackie with PCL Electric. They're the company that's expanding this location. She's gonna tell us about the different components and what they're called. Okay, so here we have right now, the current is the eight, and these are called cabinets. Cabinets. Or, or ports. Cabinets or ports. And these are the current ones that are in Woodbridge, Virginia. We are adding two additional ports and cabinets. They're adding, yeah, that we're working on right now. That's right, and they'll there. be ready um, we will basically be turning over officially Tuesday to Wednesday of next week, so October 24th, 25th, okay. 2017. All right, I have a video about that too, showing the, what looks like yep. uh, what they're doing over there. All right, so these are ports and cabinets. Mm -hmm. and these are ports and cabinets, and then we've, uh, we added one. in one addition, and these are called superchargers back here. These are the actual superchargers. All right, these white Machines. areas. Mm -hmm. All right. And then each one of these is two serves for port correct okay so i've got i've got other videos on that so if if the, if it's like number one i think this one over here services right here, one it serves as one a and one b correct so if somebody's on one a and one b at the same time they're, they're gonna have to share that electricity they are but this is where the the double conductor goes into a single conductor but yet the upgrade has been so it doesn't reduce it so much down. okay so this is the upgrade this will this is going to be upgraded with what's going in and then you're going correct. to also or somebody's going to upgrade these to my in, knowledge in the that near is future correct. and all the yes. different superchargers should be upgraded like that in the near future correct okay and then what's behind the superchargers and then behind it back here is the transformers that go which is basically all the we have the transformers for the actual superchargers, they have it, not we have the transformers. Right. And then, right. of course, the primary. That's the one, that's from the, the power company one. right that there. That is correct, yep. Okay. And then I can see on the back here it says mm -hmm. supercharger number one, 1A, one 1B, one that says yep. supercharger number two. And there, I see some antenna up there. I don't even know if you know what that is. Yep. Yeah, um, it looks like it's broadcasting something. Correct. That has information that goes back to Tesla. You can see that. It's hard to All see. All the that data one. that they. There it is. Okay. All right. Well, anything yep. else? I think that's. That's no, a good we, like I said, we um, we've learned. You know, it's a lot of people don't realize. A lot of Tesla drivers, I think, and I'm sure it's it's trial and error. But um, even some even some Tesla drivers call them um, call them fuel pumps. Yeah, I know. So that's what somebody <laughs> they still call them fuel pumps. Somebody so. when they first saw them said it looked like a weak fuel pump. And, you know, <laughs> and it's crazy because um, some people are concerned whether or not, and you can walk right up to them. I'm sure you've done them, Mike. You know, but a lot of people you can walk right up. You know, when you when you walk up to them, they they won't hurt you. You know, nothing's going to yep. shock you. Nothing's there's nothing that you need to plug in. Or and it, and it doesn't matter if it's raining yep. and if it's wet. It, it's it, you'll still be okay. That is correct. But it only works. These only work in Teslas. I think if anybody watching yes. this video probably knows. That. I've seen somebody come up with another electric car and try to plug this into yes. it and realize it doesn't fit. That is correct, <laughs> and that is something that all Tesla drivers, you know, but the biggest thing is I think Tesla drivers don't know, or, or if they're a new Tesla driver, that you can walk right up to it. There's no, you don't have to put a card in. There's no tent that you have to wait right. for. If you're, and I don't know if you know, realize this or not, but if you're grandfathered in like my vehicle is, it's free. Yep. But on the newer ones that are being sold, some of them you can get still free supercharging, but most all the Model 3s are a pay model. So you can plug it in, like you said, right. but then, the computer inside your own car right. is going to start running up the bill, right. and then it's going to be—it's going to be paid. Yeah, you got to sure pay it. You know, right? It's individualized. You know, with with your with your car, whether you you know. But that's, um, I think, for a lot of questions that we have noticed, just being workers here, is um, and what we've learned um, is that hey, is it okay to turn on, or how do they do it, or, or will this hurt me? Right. Um, you know, and I'm sure it can be probably a little frightening at first for you if, you, if you've never done that, but um, also I'm sure your Tesla sales rep would probably show you as yep. well when you get your car. Alright, well thanks for the explanation about all this. Yep. Glad. Thanks, Mike.